well, a laughing ladybug. Now to uncover what Detective Tigger has detected. When Detective Tigger tell the story about a honey jar that's missing, you can solve the crime every time. All you have to do is listen, 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 shh, listen. <laughs> So, oh, you want to solve mystifying mysteries? First, we gotta recreate the scene of some baffling old cases of mine. Here's how to solve them the Detective Tigger way. I'm gonna read from my detective notes, and you just listen to what I say. Then, you get to use these official detective thingamadoodles and move them onto this big board when I say to. When we reach the end of the case, I'll ask you the solution to the mystery, and you click on the right thingamagiggy. <laughs> Not just anybody can be a detective, you know. Gotta pass the test. Listen to five of my most famous cases. Cases. Every time you finish a case, you get a star on the edge of the board there. Get all five stars, and you qualify for your very own detective license. The case of the noisiest noise, in which I, Detectable Tigger, had to detect who was playing what in the marching type band. Pooh Boy was leading the band through the woods. March old Pooh Boy onto the big board. Hmm, maybe it's some other kind of other one. Go to my detectifying notepad any time you want me to repeat myself. Pooh Boy was leading the band through the woods. March old Pooh Boy onto the big board. He was playing one rootin' tootin' flute. So, I give Pooh a flute to toot. I detect a genius at work. Little Roo was in the band too. Bring the little guy on over. Roo? Roo was drumming a drum. Give Roo a drum to drum. Drum. <laughs> Piglet was in the band too. Move Piglet on over to the board. Piglet. He had a big old pair of clanging, banging cymbals. Give Piglet some cymbals to clang. Sim <laughs> Now your detectifying question. Who was playing the drum? Great going! It was Rue who was drumming that old drum to beat the band. The case of the simply single stick in which I, Detectifying Tigger, had to detect who had the one stick for playing poo sticks. One fine day, Pooh was out on the bridge, bringing old Pooh Boy on to the big board. Owl was on the bridge, too. Now move Owl to the board. Owl. Unbelievable. Eeyore was there with him. Move Eeyore on over. Eeyore. Pooh had a stick. Give old Pooh Boy a stick to hold, would ya? Stick. Electrifying detectifying. Eeyore had a piney cone. Give Eeyore the pine cone. Pine cone. Owl had a beautiful daffodilical flower. <laughs> Go ahead and give Owl a flower. Flower. Delicious detecting. 
Now your detectable question. Who had the stick for playing poo sticks? That's right. Pooh Bear had it. <laughs> and that's nothing to shake a stick at. Case closed. The case of the Roman red shirt, in which I, Detective Tigger, had to detectify who got Rabbit's red shirt. Bunny Boy was doing his dirty laundering out by the clothesline. You can put Rabbit onto the big board, if you will. Rabbit! Mrs. Kanga hopped out and stopped by to help him. Hop Kanga on out there! Kanga! It is perfection of detection. She had a blue shirt with her. Go on and give Kanga the blue shirt. Pooh Bear was helping, of course. Put Pooh on out there. You're no defective detective. <laughs> Pooh Boy had a red shirt with him. Give Pooh Bear the red shirt. Kanga put the bluer one on the clothesline. Go ahead, hang the blue shirt up there. Blue. Electrifying detectifying. Now for your detective question. Who has Rabbit's red shirt? Good detecting. Pooh Boy had it. But that's okay, because Pooh will give you the shirt off his back any old day. <laughs> The case of the very disappointing lunch, in which I, Detectable Tigger, had to detect who ate Owl's last jar of honey. One afternoonish day, Owl was in his house. Yeah, you could put Owl on the big board. Owl won't give a hoot. <laughs> he was holding his very lastest jar of honey. Go on and give the jar of honey to Owl. It is perfection of detection. Little Piglet came by for lunch. Bring Piglet on in. Owl gave Piglet the honey jar. Go ahead and pass the honey jar to Piglet. <laughs> it is perfection of detection. Then Tigger, who is me, came by to say hello. Bring the Tigger, who is still me, on in. Piglet don't like honey so much, so Piglet gave the jar of honey to me, Tigger. Go on and give that jar of honey to Tigger, who's me, Tigger. Definitely. Now your detective in question. Who had Owl's left this jar of honey? Incredible. You detected that Tigger... I had to laugh this jar of honey, but I didn't eat the honey, honest. <laughs> the case of the never ending walk in the woods, in which I, Detective Tigger, had to detect who was left out in the woodsies. Old Rabbit was all alone by his little long eared self out in the woods one day. Okie dokie. Move Rabbit onto the bigger board. Only Gopher was with him, too. Put Gopher on there, too. Rabbit! <laughs> and of course, Pooh Boy was hanging around with him. <laughs> Bring Pooh on out to join the fun. Rabbit went home. Move Rabbit back to the little board. Rabbit. Fantastical. Gopher left too. <laughs> Take Gopher off of the big board and move him on to the little board. Gopher. Now your detective's detecting question. Who got left in the woodsies? You detected that Pooh Bear was left in the woods that day. I'm electing you to do more detecting. <laughs> You're good at this stuff. Well, it's...
clear to me. Every good detective needs a magnifying glass. Let's get her back to your tree house. On account of your remarkable ability to listen to clues and solve the bafflingest cases, I award you this officious Tiger Detectifying License. To play this game again, click the pink balloon. To play this game at the next level, click the orange balloon. To go back to the woods and find something else to do, click the light blue balloon. Come back anytime you want to crack up some more cases.